My name is Chinadu, C-H-I-N-E-D-U, and this is PSA Radio. I'm here to make this video about the uh, verdict for the George Zimmerman trial. To be honest, I wasn't even sure I was going to make a video, but as soon as the verdict hit, I got like 70 messages to my uh, Gmail account in like an hour I, about making a video. So, um, making a video. I first saw the, uh, I saw the, the results of it. Me, me and my wife, we, uh, we were in we were in New Orleans, uh, and I mean I'm gonna be honest. I was watching Kevin Hart on Comedy Central because like I I've been watching so much of the trial. I wanted to like step away from it until the verdict came in. So I, I, was, I was watching Kevin Hart on Comedy Central during the commercial. I was flipping in between, and then I seen the verdict. Woke my wife up. My wife looked shocked. I was shocked because I'm gonna be real. I thought. I thought they were gonna get him on manslaughter. Like I wasn't sure if they were gonna get him on the murder charge. To be just to be real, just because, as much as I do believe, you know, he profiled him. You know, you know, I do believe Joe Zimmerman was wrong completely. As much as I do, as much as I believe he's wrong, in Florida, that's their laws in Florida. So, you know, it just it didn't it, it didn't work out in Trayvon Martin's favor. You know, I'm gonna be real. The, ver the verdict really didn't surprise me, honestly, because this is the same state that let Casey Anthony off. And like, I don't know what y'all views on in that, but to me, like for real, so that's Florida. I'm not dissing Florida. I'm just saying, you know, they've had some, some crazy cases like this. You know, it's not the first time. You know, I believe they're still finding ballots in the water of Florida from the 2000 election. Remember that? They just Al Gore. But anyway, my 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 reaction is more so about how people reacted, and I do feel I do feel a good a good a good amount of people acted very maturely to me uh, from what from some of the things that I saw. You know, there was, people weren't making it about race. A lot of people put things in perspective, like you know, you know, I saw a lot of different races. You know, really sympathize for the family though, because at the end of the day, you can't look at it from a race perspective. You gotta look at it from, from a family perspective. Like the person that killed their son gets to walk walk free and their son is dead he's not coming back he's gone forever he's gone and it's like that to me at the end of the day that's what it's about it was about getting justice for those people it wasn't about the movement it wasn't about people getting on facebook putting hoods on their head and acting like they making a difference when that all they really did was change their profile picture i don't know why people think that makes a real difference i don't know why um, let's talk about that real quick. I don't understand how people are getting on Facebook extra charged up, all, all, all that, all that foolishness. I'm gonna kill George Zimmerman. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. How about you sit down, learn the legal system, and try to help it to make sure that something like this don't happen again? Instead of changing your profile picture to Trayvon Martin, getting extra turned up, and acting crazy around white people, don't do that. Don't do that. People, I feel there have been too many sacrifices made by by great leaders before us and just and just everyday citizens that took a stand before us for us to like fall apart and start acting ignorant now i don't understand this i feel this was the bitter pill of our generation honestly to remind us of what what it really is and i'm not saying it's you know i'm not saying our world is cold 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 corrupt though but our world's cold 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 corrupt for real and we need to wake up, get off YouTube, stop twerking, stop acting a fool, stop giving us, giving ourselves these stupid Facebook names, stop focusing on how good your Facebook life looks, and get into the real world and start making a difference for real. Like I, I swear, like so many people that I see on my Facebook timeline are models, they're actresses, they're rappers, all this other stuff, like all all this make believe stuff that they're not even that they're not even really doing. I felt this is this to let you know that what is really going on in our world. So what are you going to do about it? Are you going to keep on Facebooking and living in La La Land? Or are you going to wake up, get in the real world, and start making a difference for stuff? I'm going to tell you something true. For real, for real. A lot of people think the PSA radio is my, like, everyday job. And, hold on one second. I'm sorry, I, 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 I checked that. I got a, a fundraiser coming up. Well, let me get to that in a second. A lot of people think that PSA Radio is like 
my everyday job for some reason and it's not um my my everyday job is i i, I own a distributing company and i also run a nonprofit organization the nonprofit organization is called american global rescue um and what's so funny about that is that my charity we help a lot of people in the greater houston area you know uh from here new jersey california arizona uh, you know, more uh, recently, uh, Oklahoma, and we also have a lot of people in Nigeria. A lot of people in Nigeria, as many people as we can. And we, we, when it comes down to like the races of our like contributors, we, we, we literally have no black people involved. Literally none. Like the majority of the people that donate and do things like that and volunteer are white. Yep, they're white. So, what are we doing? Are we twerking, you know. Some people are, just, you know, I'm not knocking all black people, but some people are doing their thing. But I, I, but I'm speaking just to my race specifically. What are we really doing to help the situation? What have we been doing? What have we been doing? Have we been sleeping? Yes, we've been sleeping. So let's wake up. Let's start making a difference for stuff.